You've heard of headbutting bighorn sheep, musk oxen, and goats that charge into each other as a show of dominance and for mating purposes. That hurts. Well, any modern day animal often has a prehistoric equivalent, and this fossil belonged to such a dinosaur. Hello everyone, welcome to Paleostoric, and today we have another rare and cool fossil, Pachycephalosaurus spikes. Now, specifically, it is of the genus Pachycephalosaurus and originates from the Hell Creek Formation in North America. It dates back to the late Cretaceous, which is around here on the geologic timescale. That's around 100 million to 66 million years ago. As for the dimensions, it has a width of about 4 centimeters, a height of about 3 centimeters, and a depth of about 3.5 centimeters. For this specimen, there are three prominent spikes here, here, and here. This one is just over 1.5 centimeters. This one measures about two or three centimeters depending on where you start. And this one is smallest at around four to five millimeters. Now, Pachycephalosaurus means thick headed lizard. And it was a bipedal dinosaur, meaning it walked on two legs. Also, it was a herbivore eating plants and grew to a length of around 15 feet. It is infamous for its large, thick dome on top of its skull. Some paleontologists argue that this dome was used much like how animals such as rams or musk oxen headbutt each other to either get mates or display dominance. This was based on evidence of scars and healed wounds on the top of some Pachycephalosaurus fossil skulls. However, Others doubt such behavior, saying, for example, that the neck vertebrae of Pachycephalosaurus were not strong enough to counteract such force during the collisions and would have caused them to break their necks. It is possible that these domes were used for flanking by charging the sides of other Pachycephalosaurus, like how giraffes fight. Looking back at the skull, though, you can see just how prominent this dome is. In fact, this dome could reach a thickness of up to 10 inches. Spikes or nodes like these ones surrounded the dome on the back, sides, and front of the skull, giving it a bizarre, unique look. It is important to note that these spikes were actually components of the skull, and not simply attachments. This is evident with the cranial or skull features and structures that can be seen on the base and over here. Thus, unlike dinosaur teeth, which could be shed throughout the lifetime of a dino, the pachycephalosaurus had to pass away for these spikes to fossilize as part of its skull. Pachycephalosaurus fossils, in general, are pretty rare, especially skull elements like these spikes. A dinosaur census recorded as part of the Hell Creek Project found the relative abundance of Pachycephalosaurus to only be 1% of the population, significantly lower than some of the other well-known Hell Creek dinosaurs, like the Triceratops and Tyrannosaurus. Although the Pachycephalosaurus continues to remain a mysterious dinosaur with the scarcity and rarity of its fossils, it is certainly a dinosaur worth admiring for its remarkable traits. Thank you all so much for watching, and please consider liking, subscribing, and hitting that notification bell to help support this channel. Happy fossils!